I'm giving away a $50 PSN card to one lucky subscriber at the end of the month. To enter for a chance to win, be sure to subscribe to this channel and leave a hashtag giveaway on any video during the month of May. The winner will be announced on my Twitter on May 31st, 2017. Good luck. Hey, what's going on guys? How do you do? It's your boy Gray here. In today's video, I wanted to bring you guys a knife only best class setup for Infinite Warfare. And before we get into that, if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to squat up and subscribe for more daily content. Don't forget to enter the $50 PSN card giveaway for the end of the month. And if you guys enjoyed this video, smash that like button for me. It would mean a lot. And uh, with that out the way, let's get back to it. So once again, in this video, I'm going to share with you my personal knife only best class setup. And this is something I don't really use much. But when I do put this set on, it definitely causes havoc out in the field. It's definitely a very smart setup, and if you have the skills, you can put in a lot of work. An example of this setup can be seen in the current gameplay you guys are watching up on the screen. This will have no edits, I will do no cuts on this video. I'm just going to let the gameplay run all the way through so you can see how effective this setup is. I ended the game going I think 31 and 10 with a knife only. Uh, actually, you know what? I did get one kill with a scarab that I stole from the opposite team, so technically, I went 30 and 10 with knife only kills, so straight up beast mode. And once again, in this class setup, I'm going to be showing you guys everything from perks to lethals and tacticals to what score streaks to run and even what rig to use. All of this will make for the ultimate knife only class setup. So with that said, let's put the class up on the screen and you guys can see it right there. So we're going to be running the combat knife as our melee weapon of choice. You can't really put any attachments or anything like that on this weapon. So following that, let's move down to perks. And for perk 1, we're going to be running ghost to help keep us off the minimap when UAVs are called. And uh, this is going to be very useful since there's going to be a lot of running involved when running a knife only class. Uh, also in perk 1, we're going to be running overclock and what this will do this is going to be very crucial to have a successful run with a knife only class especially since we're going to be running a certain rig that will optimize our use of the knife moving on over to perk 2 i'm going to be running momentum which helps us sprint faster over time even though jumping and sliding and wall running will slow it down in general if we are just sprinting running it's definitely important to have that speed boost and finally, moving on to perk 3, we're going to be running Dead Silence to help silence our footsteps and jetpacks. You know, while running a knife only class, a lot of the time you will be in pursuit of someone or maybe just coming up from behind someone and you don't want to make any noise. So uh, Dead Silence is definitely going to help with that. And also as a perk 3, we're going to be running Engineer, which will help us detect enemy equipment that the enemy has either placed or is using in the field. So this is very important because a lot of the time we're just going to be running running around at a fast pace we might not be able to catch certain things in the field so engineer will help us out with that now following these perks for our lethal we are going to be running the fletch hit grenade but truthfully you can run any lethal that you prefer and for tactical as well i'm going to be running personal radar just to give us that added sense of where the enemy is on the field but you can run whatever uh, uh tactical that you feel would be best now moving along here in the best class setup for a knife only set uh, it's very important that you run a combat rig that will complement the combat knife. And that rig is FTL. You're going to want to run FTL combat rig with the payload FTL jump. Because that is going to come in handy, especially if you're running around and come across an enemy who spots you from a few feet away and you can't reach him. There's nothing you can do. He has a weapon, like a, he has a gun, you just have a knife, so he's probably going to catch you in the act. So FTL jump will definitely help you close that little gap between you guys and you can actually get him before he gets you. And you guys have probably captured it on the screen there during this gameplay. FTL jump has definitely helped me out throughout that gameplay. I probably wouldn't have gotten most of the kills that I got without that FTL jump to help me just bridge that gap between us. And uh, yeah, so once again, FTL jump as a payload is a key. And when you have overclock as a perk, your payload loads faster, giving you more uses throughout the game, which is extremely important. Uh, also, for your trait, you're going to want to run Power Slide because that's another form of way to help close the gap between yourself and the enemy. 
And finally guys, the last thing you will need to make this knife only class the best possible class is the right score streaks. And running these score streaks will definitely enhance your gameplay. So if you know for a fact that you're going to be running knife only class, make sure that your score streaks consist of a UAV to help point out enemies in the field, counter UAV to block any means of sight for the enemy even though that you're even though you're running ghosts like like me here, even though you're going to be running ghosts if you use this class setup even though you're running ghost sometimes the mini map can let the enemy know where you are based on where people are shooting or spawn points and finally you're gonna also want to run care package just on the off chance that it gives you something pretty beast me personally i like to run the epic care package which guarantees a higher grade drop so that's definitely something strong to have especially if you do go on streaks so there you guys have it there is my personal knife only best class setup i hope you guys try this out in the field put it to work let me know if you do run a knife only class let me know what you put as your perks and stuff like that i would love to hear what you run and if you guys are new to the channel be sure to squat up and subscribe for more daily content don't forget to enter the 50 dollars psn card giveaway for the month of may smash that like button for me if you enjoyed this video turn on notifications all that good stuff for your boy till the next one thank you for watching my name is gray peace
Good job. Report to command for debrief.